Welcome back, my fellow Kid Club adventurers. I hope you've been listening to Mr. Jim's messages and looking out for Bobo. Did you know that Bobo loves stories? So today we're going to have a story time. We're going to read Easter Is For Me by Christine Tangvald. Now this story is so much fun because at home you get to interact with us as we go along in the story. Every time that I point to For Me, you're going to say it with us. Easter Is For Me. And in the story, there's pictures with red words underneath. Every time we get to a picture with a red word, you're going to say it with us. For instance, Easter is a glad and happy day. Are you ready for this story? I know Bobo is. Here we go. Easter is for me. Did you know that Easter is for me? It is. Easter is a glad and happy day. I like to watch the on Easter morning, don't you? I like to hide Easter eggs and try to find them, don't you? And I like to dress up in my very best clothes when we go to church on Easter Sunday. Don't we look great? Oh yes, Easter is a glad and happy day. A day of new life for me. But why am I so happy at Easter time? What happened so long ago on the first Easter morning? Something wonderful happened. Something important happened. Something from God. You see, Jesus. is God's own son. Did you know that? He is, in fact, Jesus. is God's only son. And God loved the world so much that he gave his only son Jesus for me. Jesus came for, for me. me. First, something Sad. happened, something very, very Sad. It happened long ago, high on a hill near a city called Jerusalem. On a dark, dark day, Jesus died on a cross. All of Jesus's friends were so Sad. The cross reminds me that Jesus died to pay for my sins. He did it for me. Jesus died on a cross to pay for my sins. John 3 16 but guess what Jesus. did not stay dead oh no he did not on that first Easter day God raised Jesus. right up from being dead he raised him for you and for me after one two three days and Angel. rolled the huge stone away from the tomb Jesus. friends looked inside where is Jesus? they asked he is not here said the he is alive, Jesus. is risen from the dead. Why, it's a miracle, said Jesus. Friends, it's a miracle of new life. God made Jesus alive again with new life. Matthew 28, 1 through 7. Then do you know what happened? After 40 days, God lifted Jesus. straight up, up, up into heaven. It's true. Wow. You see, Jesus died and became alive again so he could be my very own Savior. Jesus died and rose for me. Now, Jesus watches over and loves me all the time. If I believe in Jesus, then all my sins are forgiven. And that is why I'm so happy on Easter Sunday because Easter is for me. New life is for me. God lifted Jesus up, up, up into heaven. Acts 1, 9 and Ephesians 2, 8 and 9. At Easter time, so many things remind us of Jesus. new life. We call these things symbols. The sunrise is a beautiful symbol for Easter. Do you like to watch the sunrise? I do. Early on Easter morning, people are filled with joy of a bright new day. The sunrise reminds us that Jesus rose from the dead with new life for me. People are filled with joy. John 1, 8. I love to dye Easter eggs. Bright colors, don't you? Red. Ones. Blue. Ones. Yellow. Ones. Green. Green ones. Which one is your favorite color? Red. And Easter egg is a symbol of new life. At first, an egg looks dead. It looks like a stone. Then suddenly, crack, out pops a living baby. Bird. Peep, peep, cheep, cheep. What a surprise, a surprise of new life. 
Easter eggs are a symbol of new life. Have you ever watched a fuzzy, creepy crawly? Caterpillar. Uh, Caterpillar. Crawls up and down and all around. Then he does a very strange thing. He wraps himself all up in a thin thread. Around and around he wraps and he makes a cocoon. Is he dead? No, he's not. Out of the cocoon flies a beautiful butterfly. Swish swoosh. Don't you think the butterfly is a wonderful symbol of new life? The butterfly is a symbol of new life. Have you ever seen a flower like this one? A is a hard, dry root. The looks dead. But if you plant the in the ground, something wonderful happens. A plant begins to grow and beautiful burst into bloom Flowers. like a shiny red tulip, tulip a pretty yellow daffodil, daffodil a regal white lily, lily that smells so good. Mmm, sniff, sniff. The beautiful spring flower flowers remind me of new life. Pretty flowers remind me of new life. The Bible tells me to make a joyful noise unto the Lord. On Easter morning, it's time for the sounds of joy. Ding dong, ring dong, chime the Easter. Bells. They seem to say this is a happy, happy day. The choir starts to sing, Jesus Christ is risen today. I can sing too. Glory, glory, hallelujah. I love the happy sounds of Easter, don't you? The happy sounds of Easter are sounds of joy. Psalms 101. All of the symbols of Easter remind me of new life. The cross reminds me that Jesus died to pay for my sins and was raised from the dead with new life for, for me. me. The sunrise and the Easter eggs and the butterfly and the flowers all remind me of a new life in heaven, a new life with Jesus that will last forever and ever. You see, because I believe in Jesus as my very own Savior, I will have new life in heaven someday, too. Yay! Hooray! Oh, yes, I do believe in Jesus. I really, really do. Thank you, God. Thank you Jesus. for my new life. I'm so glad that Easter is for, for me. me. The end. I'm so glad you could join us. I hope you come back again for the next story time and keep a lookout for that Bobo. See you next time.